This is Soraya. He likes to save money and spend it wisely. This is Jeremy. He likes to spend money and spend it on whatever he wants. Throughout the week, we'll see how their spending habits affect their long-term savings. Here is Soraya. He chooses to walk to school each day, which saves him a lot over time. And here is Jeremy approaching in his car. Jeremy chooses to drive to school each day and also buy an expensive coffee, and these two things add up a lot over time. Again, we see Jeremy, who makes a poor financial decision by buying many different junk food items for himself and his friends at lunch. a more frugal decision by bringing his own bag lunch each day. In this scene, Jeremy takes his girlfriend to the movies, and they get popcorn for them to share. This is an expensive form of entertainment. As compared to Soraya, who chooses to stay home and make a more economically smart decision by watching Netflix on his own computer. Here, Jeremy takes his girlfriend to an expensive dinner. He also chooses to leave a large tip for the waiter. Instead of what Jeremy does, Soraya chooses to make a more responsible and financially smart decision of staying home, studying, and eating ramen. In this scene, Jeremy continues to spend his money at the mall. He buys clothes, shoes, and video games, versus Soraya, who instead chooses to save his money and go straight to the bank with it. Here we are at the end of the week, and they arrive at Bitterford Savings Bank. We can see the repercussions for the economic decisions they made throughout it. Jeremy is only able to deposit a quarter into his savings account because of the decisions he made throughout the week. Soraya is able to deposit much more than Jeremy because of the financially educated decisions he made throughout the week. Jeremy is sad because he has no more money. Soraya comforts him by telling him he should start saving at Bedford Savings Bank.